Hi, today we are going to discuss prostatitis. Prostatitis is the is diagnosed by two symptoms lead to prostatitis. One is the perineal pain, and another is uh, the widening difficulty. Prostatitis is defined as the inflammation of prostate. Now, when a patient comes to you, he says, uh, "Doc, I have widening difficulty." and I have perineal pain, your brain goes towards prostatitis. Now you know prostatitis is acute and chronic. Acute is caused by E. coli, Enterobacter, Enterobacteriaceae family or Enterococcus and Calypsula and Pseudomonas. The four organisms and then we have that in acute prostatitis we have a triad. What is that triad? We have fever, fever, dysuria and fever, dysuria and the another thing is uh, perineal pain which we already discussed that we have fever, dysuria, perineal pain, fever, dysuria, perineal pain and this is the triad fever, perineal pain, dysuria this is acute prostatitis okay and then we have when we uh, lead to when we go on discussing acute prostatitis and we have <coughs> complications of acute prostatitis one is abscess septicemia and a recurrent uh, a recurrent orchidu it is epididymo orchitis we have recurrent epididymo orchitis we have three complications of acute we have three complications of acute prostatitis one is abscess formation second is septicemia third is ep epididymo orchitis recurrent epididymo orchitis we have three symptoms and now we go to dre on dre we have three things it is red it is tender it is red it is tender it is warm it is red tender warm we see we diagnose it by dysuria, fever, and perineal pain. On DRU, you find red, tender, and warm. We have three complications. One is abscess formation, recurrent epididymo orchitis, septicemia. We do three investigations, initial FBE. Second, we did you culture and sensitivity. And third, we do uh, PSA levels then we have three treatments one is for mild amoxicillin and we have trimethoprim amoxicillin trimethoprim sulfamethoxazole then we have for moderate amoxicillin oral plus IV genta IV genta mycin then we have abscess formation treatment of we do endoscopic derouping okay then we have chronic bacteriatitis symptoms of acute persistent for greater than three months we call it acute chronic prostatitis chronic prostatitis is treated by giving doxycycline or ciprofloxacin now we don't go for acute treatment we go for chronic doxycycline or ciprofloxacin one of them and we have that in this we don't have fever in chronic in chronic we have mild irritation or pain during widening perineal sacrotal or sacrotal pain and suprapubic pain these are the three things that is it thank you